today. Uh, we're starting our track build on the 280Z. It's behind me. You guys can just barely see the windshield. I mean, get over here. All right, what we're going to do today is take off everything we don't need. So instead of going through that with you guys, what I'm going to do is put you on a time lapse, I guess. Or just speed up the film so you don't have to watch it. We're going to remove the uh, air conditioning system and stuff like that. We're going to build this for a track car, not necessarily a quarter mile track car, but more of a time trial track car. So, got the hood off so we can get to everything. We got a lot of new parts to put on it, a lot of things. So, after we get this stuff removed, we'll get back to you. All right, see you in a bit. This is what we got took off. All them pieces. My bad. Okay, this is where we got. This is the space we cleared up. I'm going to take you into the engine bay. All the hoses and stuff ran through here. Here's where they went into the firewall. Uh, the condenser was right here. And it had a hose that ran across here uh, behind the radiator. There's a radiator for the air conditioner in front of the radiator. Our bracket and everything for the air conditioner was right down here. And we removed the pulleys and everything off of it. And let's see. That's pretty much all the air conditioner parts we removed. So now, oh, and instead of cutting anything, everything is in one piece. So if somebody needs it, let me know. Um, next thing we're going to do, we got a lot of things to do, but we're going to check our vacuum lines and we're going to we're going to replace the vacuum lines that need to be replaced because honestly, we got a bunch of leaks. So I'm going to set the camera back up. All right, here's where your EGR sets. We remove the EGR. We have the delete plate with gasket, but if you look, I don't know if you can see this here, this will show you, there's a hole, okay, you got to fill that, and most people use a TIG to fill that hole, I don't have a TIG, I have a MIG, but not a TIG, so what we're going to use is a JV weld, and it's like a stick stuff, and when I find it, I'll show it to you. And we're going to mash it in this hole. And there's another hole that enters right here. And we'll be filling that hole as well. And then we can put our delete back. Here's the stuff. Let me get it up here so you guys can see it. By JV Weld. Uh, it's just a tube. Two chemicals in it and you knead it together and you let it set and it hardens up still hard so I'm gonna go ahead and get this kneaded up and get it on there and after that's done I'll show you what it looks like all right
today. Um, I know some of y'all are wondering what the heck happened to the wine, or what the heck happened to your videos, period. Well, what happened was uh, I ended up having a little bit of heart trouble. So, I thought about just killing the channel altogether, which I did for four months. I got this car as a hobby, something to do, while I'm trying to get my heart back the way it should be. Only a few people knew I was having problems, but now all y'all know. Um, I'll be back it, it, to the wine, to the cars, to everything. It's just, I have to go so much slower now. Um, that it throws you off when you're trying to get something done. Alright. Enough of my whining. And not about the wine. Um, we're going to make this into a track car. Do we think we'll ever take it to the track ourselves? Probably not. Uh, are we making it into a track car to resell? Maybe. Probably. Are we going to let our wife drive it? Most definitely. And... Maybe we can teach our son how to drive a stick in this car. I don't know. But I thank y'all for watching. And I guess this is it. I could go ahead and start the car. And we'll see if it did any better. We did get rid of all of the extra vacuum line we could find. Uh, it's not 100%. Some of, the, some of the hoses are just no good. And I don't have all the different pieces. But I can take you guys over and show you everything. So here we go. We rerouted hoses. Uh, we rerouted uh, some of our grounds. Uh, deleted the uh, EGR and the associated pieces that go with it. Um, got rid of the, you guys saw the cooler. We need to get a new boot. Here's the other boot. But we need to get a new boot for the air cleaner. But that should do it. So let's crank it over a couple times and see if we can't get this thing to start. All right, and we'll put you all right here. There we go. Thanks. Later.